Let's head down to the coin toss now. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. Taken at the 5. At the 30. And down he goes at the 32. The Mustangs been talking with them this week, Kirk. It's just interesting, their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'd be shocked if they can slow him down. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Strike to his receiver, no good. The ball just sailed on him, and he knows it. He'll get it next time. the middle for a nice game. Pretty good gain on the play by the halfback. He got seven, but it looked like for a second he could have broken it for even more. Good call. It's first and ten. Ball on the 49. Makes it out to about the 36. There's nothing more effective that a team can do offensively than to pound the ball right at the defense, trying to wear them down. Here's the give. Brought down at the 21. So with that run, they pick up another first. Just a nice job again up front by the offensive line. They're doing a good job of neutralizing the defensive front, and it's allowed them to move the ball down the field. From the 21-yard line, it's first down. Here he goes. And he gets the touchdown. point. It was a six-play, 68-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, not only did they put points up on the board, but I think it's the way they did it. Now, that could be demoralizing for a defense. So our score, 7-0. He'll return it from the three. Fumble! It's picked up. He's tackled at the 31-yard line. The Mustangs are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. From their own 31-yard line, first down. Nice run, and he's brought down. the receiver incomplete Number one, the receiver. from their own 35 yard line it's third down he's on the run they'll bring him down at the 43 yard line and that is going to be enough for the first. You and I talked about him earlier in the game. What impressed me there is he knew exactly where he needed to go to get the first down the whole time. Big opening. He's tackled at the 46-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 46. Make 
takes it to the 34. play here by the senior to make the sure tackle. It's not very often that someone's able to shake this guy. From the 31 yard line, second down. Zips it to the back. And they make the stop at about the 21. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Lead and pushed out of bounds behind the line. Here's play number 10 on the drive. He steps up. Throws it in a hurry, and he's taken down around the 19-yard line. I think he could have taken a risk down the field, but he played it safe instead, and that's one of the keys to winning ball games. And so it's another third down upcoming here. And they've got the dive package in there to try and deal with this five-receiver look. Throws, and he's got a man. Touchdown. tight end. This guy can play some football. You bet he can. He's such an all-around player. He's just as good at blocking as he is at catching the football. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he hits the PAT. So a 10-play, 68-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Fred, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. From the five yard line. Gets to about the 27 yard line. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. And now he's got room to run. And he's tackled in the open field. From their own 38-yard line, first down. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Play fake that time. That is a loss of six. That'll make it second and long. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. Screen pass. He's got his half back. He's knocked out of bounds at the 46. Quick throw, tackle made at the 32-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 32-yard line. And down he goes, right around the 34. So at the end of one quarter, we get a tie game at 7-7.
Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Fires back to the tailback, but he can't bring it in. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 22. for a sack on the play. He'll try to change the field position and especially not get it to the end zone. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. One left, and he's taken down to the backfield. throws it away. That's going to bring up fourth down. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. Brought down at the 41-yard line. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Tackle at the 37. From the 37-yard line, it's first down. Knocked down, incomplete. Smart, heady play by that defender. That was solid, fundamental pass defense. That makes it second and ten. Screen pass gets it to the back. He's taken down around the 33 yard line. Third down, and they need to get it to the 27. Here's the give. Nice run up the middle. So the halfback gets some decent yards and a first down. He took advantage of a powerful effort by his offensive line to turn that into a pretty big run. Man, did he play that perfectly or what? As a linebacker, you have to be able to read the offense and make a quick diagnosis, which is exactly what he did on that play. From the 29-yard line, second down. And they'll run him again. He fights forward to about the 29. looking for his man and that one's incomplete that'll bring up fourth and long and we should be seeing the kicker here good stand by the defense to keep them out of the end zone on this drive 
Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. Plenty of time in the pocket. Swings it out there incomplete. Big stop by the defense. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. He gets out to about the 37-yard line. Two minutes to go in the half. A nice job by the offensive line, and they pick up a gain of eight. The offense calls a timeout, and that was their first timeout. Here's an opening. Makes it out to about the 49. Slings it. That's a great tackle at the 45. Number 99 with the tackle at the 45 yard line. From the 45 yard line, it's second down. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. That is a loss of four yards. That brings us third and ten. Right now, he wants to get this kick away and change field position. He takes it at the 14. Tackle made at the 22-yard line. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Brought down around the 35-yard line. The Mustangs taking their first time out of the half. From their own 35-yard line, first down. Throws complete. He's got space to work. They'll bring him down right around the 46-yard line. Well, the quarterback's able to find a soft spot in the defense, and he threw an accurate ball for a solid pickup. Junior. And he hits him hard at the 33 yard line. And he's level at the 40. the catch and gets out of bounds. That makes it first and ten. From the 22-yard line, first down. And he almost has the INC. Great reaction to get his hands in the way of that pass. That's not an easy play to make. This is the eighth play of this drive. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. Oh. 
This kick return should conclude the first half. Don't be surprised to see some trickery here. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 30-yard line. Well, we're headed to halftime now, and we're seeing two defenses that don't want to give an inch. The Mustangs lead 10-7. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Ball security was a major theme coming into this game, and both offensive coordinators have to be thrilled with the fact that their offenses, first and foremost, did a good job of taking care of the ball. And you don't see it every game, that's for sure, that both teams don't have a turnover at the half. And you usually see those critical mistakes that set up a short field for you to take advantage of. And, and it's definitely nice. It's nice to be able to put in a plan all throughout the week and to be able to execute it and not to be able to make those big mistakes. Because coaches will tell you, it's those big mistakes that kill you. It's okay to be rushed in the pocket as a quarterback and then throw it to your mom in the third row. Don't throw it in harm's way. Both quarterbacks done a good job, and as a result, both teams with zero turnovers in the first half. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Red and Kirk ready to take you home in the second half. Boy, I hope the second half's as good as the first. Just about set to start the third quarter in a tight one. He's to the 20. Gets out to about the 21. The Mustangs continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. He fights forward to about the 23. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Nice run, and he's brought down. That makes it third and three. Gets to around the 42. A nice third down conversion there. This offense has a tendency to run the football in this situation, as you can see, with good reason. It's first and 10. Ball on the 42-yard line. A yard, if that, on the quarterback keeper. There's a player hurt. It doesn't look to be that bad. From their own 42-yard line, second down. Hands off to the right and is brought down in the backfield. Well, Kirk, we saw this kid head to the locker room a little bit earlier with that injury. Now we see he's back on the sideline. That's good news. Looks like he should be able to get back in the action. And they got it. Boy, these kind of plays result in a lot of confidence from this defense and the defensive coordinator. I will not be surprised to see this defense continue to bring this kind of pressure against this offense. Fourth and long here after the sack. Heading for the corner. He gets hit out of bounds at the 35-yard line. Both sides have made their way back out, and we're just about set to get going again. And they make the stop at the 46-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 46. And 
and he's taken down at the 45-yard line. the 46-yard line. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. He makes his way to about the 38. That makes it first and ten. Makes it to the 24. From the 24-yard line, it's first down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Gaining four yards. That makes it second and six. Pushed out of bounds at the three. That makes it first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. defenders continue to exploit the O-line like that, it's going to be a long day for this running back. We're at play number nine of this current drive. They've got their goal line sets on the field. This might be a good time for play action. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Loss of about two. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. It's third and goal from the five. Let's see if they can put this one in. Looks to a receiver, touchdown! by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. And he tacks on the extra point. A 10-play, 65-yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass, just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. Fielded at the four. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's so check out the penalty. Clipping. Receiving team. Clipping is the call, and now they'll have to find a way to make up those yards right here. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Hands it off. And he carries the ball for a nice game. From their own 16-yard line. Second down. it out to about the 26.
So at the end of three, the Mustangs lead 17-7. in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Complete across the middle, and down he goes around the 39-yard line. From their own 39-yard line, first down. Yardage on that run. That's good for a game. That brings him second and five. They bring him down in the backfield. I think anytime you lose yardage, it's frustrating as a ball carrier. It's very frustrating as a play caller. Makes you a little bit more hesitant maybe to go back to a certain play. The biggest thing you want to do as an offensive coordinator is get the offense over to the sideline after the series, make sure everybody's on the same page, and then show the confidence that you still have in them despite this play that you're going to go right back to the running back and trust that offensive line. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. So close, but they fall short of the first down. You've got to throw the ball a little deeper next time. Don't take any chances of coming up short. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. He's at the 40. Tackle made at the 29-yard line. You know that saying, get your keys out because we're on a drive? This offense right now is on a drive. I mean, this is their third first down. They're doing just about anything they want, and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down. Here's the eighth play of the series. Here he goes. He's at the 20. He makes his way out to about the nine. And goal, and they'd love to get into the end zone and make this a game again. And now he's got room to run, and he's in the end zone. Touchdown. Here's the extra point to get within a field goal. He makes the PAT. like they're ready for the kick. He'll return it from the four-yard line. They'll bring him down at the 25-yard line. A score here might effectively end this one. some time dives for extra yardage first down 10 yards to go ball on the 37 a great tackle at the 45. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That brings a short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Just over two minutes in the game. Check. 
check. Dancing, dancing. And a quick throw. And he tackles him hard at the 44. The defense calls a timeout. First and 10. Ball on the 44-yard line. He's taken down at about the 35. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. The defense calls a timeout. And he's tackled at about the 27-yard line. You know, the defense knew that this offense was trying to work the clock. When you want to work the clock, you're going to run the football. It puts a lot of pressure on the offensive line to get low and drive that defensive line back. And that's what they were able to do there to give the running back enough room to pick up that first down. From the 22-yard line, second down. down around the 12-yard line. That's good for and this is the eighth play of the drive. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. He'll go down to one knee. And so that's going to do it. Our final score in this one, 17-14, Mustang. That brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Herb Street, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.